Hi, my dear follower, my Forex Trader family. How, hey, how are you? Uh, I hope everything is good. And um, in this video, I want to do something new for you and uh, to share with you my new way, uh, my uh, thought about a uh, good product on the market and a very good strategy that can uh, definitely help you uh, to make profits with uh, in this market, especially in uh, the intraday uh, trading. I want to share with you my thoughts, my opinions about Forex Rebellion. Uh, so first of all, what is Forex Rebellion and uh, who is the owner of this uh, strategy? It uh, developed by Russ Horn. Must, um, I guess many of you uh, know already Russ. Um, he's a great trader and very, very good friend uh, of mine. Uh, we met uh, on the Forex uh, community. And uh, we share uh, opinions once a week, twice a week, uh, and we talk about the market. And we always share uh, our strategies and our uh, thoughts about the markets. And uh, he, he created the Re uh, Forex Rebellion uh, more than a year ago. And uh, this product is uh, well known in the market and has a very good uh, reputation. And uh, a lot of people, uh, a lot of traders use it and uh, love it. I love the strategy. Why? Because uh, it is simple. It's uh, based on uh, strength uh, indicators combined with trend indicators, which uh, gives you good alert, uh, good signal uh, when to buy, when to to sell. Uh, now, what is the Forex Rebellion? It is a alert, a signal alert uh, product. Uh, you can see here Forex Rebellion EA. It's not e an EA. It's not an automated EA. It's an EA that created alerts. Once you get the alert, you see an arrow on a chart, like here. Right? Because of this is a RAS uh, product, I can share all the template as uh, as it is. So I sh I, uh, I show you only few of it. Um, one here, one uh, tool here, and of course the arrows, the signals, and uh, here one tool. But once you get it, you will see how easy and how uh, uh, easy to use it is. And uh, for this one, I added MACD, and I will explain about it uh, later. It works on uh, uh, 10 uh, uh, pairs, um, all all of the majors, Euro, Dollar, Pound, Dollar, Dollar, Canadian, Dollar, Franc, Dollar, Yen, uh, etc. And uh, Euro, Yen, Euro, Pound uh, as well. It's, uh, which is very good because uh, it's uh, variable and you can, you can choose any pair of this uh, and trade with it. So it's very, very, very comfortable and uh, um, allows uh, a lot of uh, activity, a lot of trades, and which is very, very good for, uh, especially for intraday uh, traders. But uh, for those of you who are not intraday traders, it works on daily chart and uh, for our chart as well, as you can see here. Right, as you can see here, we have uh, a good moves once uh, once it comes. As you can see, this is a daily chart, for example. All right, so uh, it works on uh, short terms, long terms, even intraday, such as uh, 15 minutes. Okay, so uh, definitely everyone can benefit from it. And of course, uh, I will uh, just share with you now uh, some trades that uh, uh, were signaled out uh, during the last week. And they will show you how I especially filter them and uh, will explain how to use this amazing tool called MACD Complete uh, together with the strategy. So first of all, once you get an alert, you will get this uh, arrow, right? Then uh, you will follow the uh, RAS manual, uh, which is also simple and uh, easy to understand. Uh, and you, you will have to filter your trades. Uh, for example, uh, here you will see some uh, another tool, and here you will have to make sure that uh, some of the conditions are met. Um, and uh, then you will have to decide and put entry order once you have the, the signal to, to enter a trade. Okay, so um, I, I want to share with you a few trades, uh, and I want to mention something very important. Many, many strategies... Uh, erasing accounts on the range market, but uh, one of the uh, advantages of the uh, Forex Rebellion is, is uh, w when you have such a market. So from all these signals, you will have only one. This is not a signal. Not uh, a signal. Two. 
not a signal, not a signal. Three. So uh, from six, uh, se six, seven uh, alerts, you will have only three. Two were uh, profitable, and one will was lose. Uh, for example, uh, you can see another example here. Okay. So in the uh, range market, uh, you, the, the filters will uh, make sure that you don't get all the trades. Uh, you will get uh, only a few of them. And uh, of course, uh, the filter will uh, take uh, must, not all, must of the um, of the trades out, and uh, you will uh, stay uh, almost with all the profitable trades. And uh, as another tr uh, filter, I add my MACD, and I will explain how to use it. So first of all, let's begin with the the last trades. All right, this was a good signal. The conditions of uh, Rust strategy were met. And take a look what happened in MACD, it crossed the zero line up, and it was a good signal, and we are uh, entering a trade here, and as you can see, it was a good profit move uh, up, okay, uh, another trade here, okay, now uh, about the MACD, make sure once the, all the conditions of Rust strategy are met, okay, uh, uh, and uh, before I before I continue, I just want to explain about the MACD. This is my favorite tool, and I uh, found that uh, if you add the MACD, it's not it it does not come with uh, for Cerberian. But if you add it, and if you don't have it, just email me, and you will get the MACD, of course. Uh, and when you add it, you filter the bad trades, and you know when to exit, and the best point, which is very important from my point of view. Well. Uh, so I uh, go back to this trade. Uh, we had the signal. Uh, conditions were met here and here. And the MACD crossed the zero line. And uh, the enter was here. You can see, right, above the uh, signal like candle. And uh, it was a good up move. The previous one here was also good. The signals were, uh, we get the signal here. The conditions were met only here during this uh, candle. Right, the MACD is below the zero line, which is very good, and the slope is going down, which is also very good. And we have, uh, sorry, from here, and we get another good move, more than 100 pips. Of course, the money uh, Russ recommend a good money management system. You can also use my principles with 80% uh, closing the first target and 20% the second target, which is also uh, also very good. And uh, to be honest, I use it this way. I don't use as uh, Russ recommended because I prefer the 80% closing the first target and 20% the second target. But it's only me. You don't ha you don't have to agree agree with me. So this was uh, two good trades. This was uh, an another uh, potential trade, but uh, we got a signal, but uh, never met the conditions, so no entry. Uh, as here, we got a signal, the conditions were met on the rebellion strategy, but the MACD is below the zero line, which is not good. So I don't ha uh, enter a trade. Okay, so I want, actually, I want the MACD to give me confirmation. If, it, if it's long, I want the MACD to be above the zero line with a slope up, all right, with a slope up. And if we go down, I want the MACD to be uh, below the zero line and with a slope down, such in this case, okay? And for example, for a long example, uh, here, this one, all right, we cross the, we get a signal, we have the conditions met, and look, the MACD it crossed up, and the slope is going up, so it was a very good trade. Right? Uh, another one was here. Okay. Now I want to share with you how uh, we exit the trade with MACD. First of all, you have the money management, but once you have the money management, and let's say you close the first target, and you are uh, now with the second target. All right. Uh, so we, uh, let's take this uh, trade for example. What can we see here? Uh, very very clear. We have a resistance line, right? We have uh, this trade is going up, up, up. We had powerful candles, big candles, and then the candles get smaller, right? When candles get smaller, that means that the bulls, why the bulls? Because they were here in this tr in this uh, trend, are getting out. And once we meet uh, this uh, resistance, I want to take a look on the MACD. What what is happening with the MACD? The slope is going down. I call it bearish divergence. Okay. May big a big possibility that from this point somewhere the uh, this pair will uh, return and be trading down. Such happened here. Okay, we got this 
uh, inverted hammer, the slope of the MACD was going down. This is amazing point to get out. Why again? I want to explain it again. We enter here, okay, on the, all the conditions met, the MACD crossed the zero line, it was trading above the zero, and the slope was going up. We got this up move, the candles will, uh, get smaller, right? And we get inverted hammer and the slope of MACD was going down, which is um, actually a bearish divergence. Well, we get out from a first one, a first target, if we still didn't close it, or a second target, if we close already the first target and we stuck only with the second target, then we close it, then we close it uh, on this uh, point. Okay, so another example for uh, uh, for exit with the MACD, uh, such in this case, take a look, we got the entry point here, right, the conditions were made all, all uh, so with the rebellion, uh, rebellion, and uh, sorry, and um, also the MACD crossed the zero line, as you can see, right, crossed the zero line during the ne next uh, candle, which is very, very good, and we're going down, 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 and then we stuck here, some sideway move, okay, sideway move, the market tried, make some attempts to go down, once again and second, they went third again down, but this uh, support line was very powerful, and take a look what happened with the MACD, you see, the stop was going up, so once I get some bullish candle pattern, such in this case, in this hammer, this one, right, you see, this hammer, right, this red one, I get out of this trade from uh, from this ceiling, okay? So, uh, uh, to summarize, uh, Forex Rebellion is a very good strategy as itself, but I found it during the, uh, more than, to be honest, more than one, half year that I traded, uh, I traded with it personally. Uh, the MACD helps a lot with this strategy, a lot. And if you use it right, I can send you. If you don't have it yet, I can send you. Just email to me, I will send it. And if you combine it the way I uh, recommended here, you will uh, filter bad trades and you will know how to exit from uh, the trades that you are already in. Uh, I found that uh, Forex Rebellion can complete uh, SRS, uh, which is uh, the way I trade uh, the Rebellion, uh, that uh, uh, once I get the signal on SRS, I make sure the Rebellion also show me uh, this uh, this direction. Such an example, I, I stay in the British Pound. For example, we got this up signal here, okay? It was on, on only under Rebellion, only under Rebellion. I will show you again here, all right? Do you remember this one, all right? No trade on the SRS because no uh, last high was broken, only here but uh, it was uh, even earlier, right? So uh, actually it's a good trade because the uh, moving average of the um, SRS crossed up, the SRS crossed up, so the good combination, and we got a very, very good uh, down move. Such in uh, this case, we got signal down on Rebellion, take a look, here it is, okay? We got a Rebellion uh, uh, trade, and here, and after two, pair, two bars, Okay, uh, we got the entry point on Rebellion. I take a look on the SRS, what happened here. Well, I was already in the SRS, right? Already in the SRS, as this, this low was broken here. So the SRS also showed down, and the combination is very, 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 very good. So uh, uh, if, uh, for those of you who like SRS, try to combine them together, and I promise you will... Uh, you will uh, love it very, very, very much because when you combine it together, it's two powerful strategies that show the same direction, uh, which is very, very, very good. And uh, if you have any questions, you can email me, or uh, if you want to ask MACD, just uh, tell me, or just Google it, MACD complete, uh, and you will find it. Uh, well, thank you very much for your time, and I wish you a good week, and uh, enjoy the Forex Rebellion. Thank you.